Actor and comedian Bill Cosby is suing seven women who had accused him of defaming them. But first, police in Brazil have broken up a ring that has been helping dozens of Syrian nationals obtain fake Brazilian IDs. More from Vicky Wong. The discovery of the fake ID scheme has raised concerns ahead of the Rio Olympics in August next year. According to Brazilian authorities, the scheme involved arranging false Brazilian birth certificates for Syrian immigrants, who then used the fake certificates to obtain valid Brazilian documents, including passports and national ID cards. The police chief responsible for the case said an extensive investigation was being carried out, as this was a matter of national security. He disclosed that many of them with the fake IDs have applied for visas to go to the United States, and among them were former members of the Syrian armed forces. Some of the passport holders have also travelled to Europe. Actor and comedian Bill Cosby is suing seven women who had accused him of defaming them, saying they lied when they accused him of sexual assault. The countersuit filed in U.S. District Court in Springfield, Massachusetts, contends that the women defamed his honorable legacy and reputation by accusing him of sexual misconduct. More than 50 women have come forward to accuse the actor, best known for his role in the television hit The Cosby Show, of sexually assaulting them after plying them with drugs or alcohol. Uh, warm, Cosby no has pain. repeatedly denied uh, wrongdoing and has never been criminally charged. I, I have... Fans were out in force for the premiere of the new movie The Force Awakens which will bring Luke Skywalker, Princess Leia and Han Solo back to their galaxy far, far away after 30 years. Fans screamed and shrieked as some of the memorable characters strutted the red carpet. There was BB-8, R2-D2 and C-3PO, as well as stormtroopers looking smart in their white uniform. Disney is guarding details about the plot of Force Awakens and the secrecy has sparked speculation, particularly about the fate of Skywalker, who has been absent from trailers and posters promoting the new film. The movie opens in American theatres on the 18th of December.